Hi everyone, in this video tutorial, we will learn how to use input file in Abacus. First, let's go to how to create our input file with EMP extension. Let's create, for example, when we create your job, for example, job one, continue, click OK. For example, we have this job. You can click on write input for create your input file or you can go to submit and we will create automatically your input file let's create input file for our model now we have let's edit and rename this file as for example emp file will simplify our instruction for example click ok EMP file or right input now we have file name with EMP file dot EMP with EMM with input extension with EMP extension this file we can use in any version of Abacus but the main limit of this file is the orphan mesh we can't modify any dimensions or any in geometry of our model but we can change material change interaction but the size of our model any dimensions or any geometry also the mesh of our model we can change all these two things let's go to for example file now we need to see how to open this file or import this file in our abacus go to file import you can use model and select emp abacus input file click ok now we have you can change you can choose one click ok for example with extension of EMP file but our file I think we have in this uh, yes this is our input file click OK now we have our model open in Abacus with input file we have part but we can make any change in our part for example let's create uh, part has no geometry add j feature created geometry first we don't have any geometry we have orphan mesh orphan model we can change material edit and also the mesh of our model we can change it we can't for example an orphan mesh part can be modified only by using edit mesh tool now let's go to edit for example edit our input file for example let's open this file with edit with notepad yes for example now we have instructions for our model our node coordinate also we have elements node sets when we created sets in our model for example and all important things we need to use but we can change dimensions and size of mesh in when we need when we use input file i hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to subscribe in my youtube channel and like this video see you